Welcome to Digital Electronics Lecture Series. I, Professor Ritesh Dholakia, is going to explain you 8 cross 1 multiplexer in this video. So, first of all, we will try to understand what will be the basic block diagram which is there with 8 cross 1 multiplexer. And to have it, we need to compare this with basic multiplexer form that is 2 to the power n cross 1 mux. And as if you compare this with this, you will be finding, you see 2 to the power 3 that is 8 means n is equals to 3 over here. So n is equals to 3 means what? There are total 3 selection lines. So with this 8 cross 1 multiplexer, we have total 3 selection lines. So let us try to form a basic block diagram. So here we have 8 cross 1 multiplexer and in that we have 3 selection lines. Let us say this selection lines are A, B and C. And as per it is 8 cross 1 multiplexer, we have total 8 input lines. So let us say these input lines are I0, I1, I2, I3, I4, I5, I6 and I7. So total 8 input lines are there. And here we have one output line. So these are my inputs. This is my output and these are my selection lines. So that is how block diagram is there. Now let us try to understand how this block diagram functions. So functioning of this block diagram that is happening based on transfer of input to output and that is what we do it by having selection line. So as if ABC that is 0, 0, 0 in that case I0 will get transferred to output Y as if ABC is 0, 0, 1 in that case I1 will get transferred to output Y as if ABC is 0, 1, 0 in that case I2 will get transferred to output Y as if it is 0, 1, 1 in that case I3 will get transferred to output Y as if it is 1, 0, 0 in that case I4 will get transferred to output Y as if it is 1, 0, 1 in that case I5 will get transferred to output Y and if ABC is 1, 1, 0 in that case I6 will get transferred to output Y and if this is 1, 1, 1 in that case I7 will get transferred to output Y and one main terminal that we should not forget that is terminal E which is enable terminal and with this enable terminal we should know this as if this is 0 in that case no matter what are the inputs output will stay 0 and if E is equals to 1 in that case only this IC is enabled then only as per selection line output will appear with respect to input lines right so let us try to make truth table from this 8 cross 1 multiplexer so that will clear our understanding so here we have enable terminal and then we have a b c selection line and then we have output terminal over here as if this E is equals to 0 then no matter what are the inputs which is there at ABC output will stay 0 and as if enable terminal is 1 in that case with ABC there are total 8 combinations so let me mention all 8 combinations so you see when enable is 1 at that time ABC is having 8 combinations and in that if ABC is 0, 0, 0, output Y will be I0. So I0 will get selected at output side. As if ABC is 0, 0, 1, then I1 will get selected at output side. If it is 0, 1, 0, then I2 will be at output side. 
if it is 0 1 1 then i3 will be at output side if it is 1 0 0 then i4 will be at output side if it is 1 0 1 then i5 will be at output side if it is 1 1 0 in that case i6 will be our output and as if it is 1 1 1 then i7 will be our output right now we need to write output equation based on this truth table so you see output equation that is this enable dot this product terms right so you see product terms are a bar b bar c bar i0 plus a bar b bar c i1 plus a bar b c bar i2 plus a bar b c i3 plus a b bar c bar i4 plus a b bar c i5 plus a b c bar i6 plus a b c i7 so that is how output equation is there with us and this output equation that we need to utilize to form a circuit of 8 cross 1 multiplexer so to form 8 cross 1 multiplexer see first we need to assign selection line over here so see we have three selection lines a b and c right and this selection lines that i am directly connecting and here i am connecting this selection line along with its inversion so not gate that is even i am connecting over here now here you can see there are a total eight product term which is there in this output equation so here i need to have total eight and gates right and this eight and gates that is what we are deal with to r right so let me provide oring operation now see we need to form all these product terms so you can see this first product term that is a bar b bar and c bar and input is i0 so here i need to connect i0 input now in second product term it is a bar b bar c so this is a bar then b bar then this c and then input is i1 over here you see now third product term that is a bar b c bar so this is a bar b c bar and this is my i2 input along with it then a bar b c i3 so this is a bar then b then c then this is i3 after that you see a b bar c bar i4 so this is a b bar c bar and i4 then a b bar c i5 so this is a b bar c and input is 
i5 then you see this product term a b c bar i6 so this is a b c bar and i6 is my input to this end and last product term that is a b c i7 so we have a b c and this is i7 right and here see we are oring all so that is what or operation and after that we need to end this terminal with e terminal so here enable terminal that we need to end with this and that is what my result and output y so this is how we can form circuit of 8 cross 1 multiplexer i hope that you have understood this